Hello everyone and welcome to our fifth and final recorder lesson together. This one we are calling Showtime because it is your turn to show off all of the amazing things you have learned in our recorder unit. So you are going to choose a song that we have learned together from the s'more page and practice it until you feel confident and ready. Then I want you to record yourself playing and you can either send it to me in an email or share it on our Flipgrid. My email is listed at the bottom of our s'more page and I have included in this week's s'more every song we have learned together. But don't feel like you absolutely have to choose one of those songs to perform. If you learned your own recorder song, you are more than welcome to perform that as well. But let me show you how we're going to access our Flipgrid. So you're going to click on the link in the S'more page and that will take you to a screen that has something like this on there. What you're going to do is you are not going to enter your student username and you are not going to scan your QR code. You're going to click right here. Enter your guest password. After you click that, it's going to take you to a page like this. I have listed our password for the Flipgrid on the S'more page. So scroll down until you see a picture that looks like this and the password is listed right there. After you enter the password, press go and it will take you to a page that will have a button like this, record a response. This topic is moderated. Moderated means that I will watch the video before I approve it for other people to watch as well. So um, if your video does not appear right away, don't stress out. All that means is, is I haven't approved it yet. It will appear once I've had a chance to review it. Once you click on record your response, if you are using a desktop, it's going to ask you to um, allow the use of your microphone and camera. So you will click allow. If you are doing this lesson on an iPad or tablet and you've downloaded the Flipgrid app, it's going to ask you the same question. Make sure you click allow. After that, it will take you to a screen like this and you're going to have a chance to record yourself playing. You can either click the redo button right here at the bottom and once you're happy with the way that it looks, you will click next. That will give you a chance to review your video See if it's what you want, and if it's what you'd like to submit, you're going to click next one more time. After that, you're going to have a chance to take a selfie, and that will be the cover of your video. The only thing you are going to need to enter is your first name and your last initial. Your first name and your last initial. You do not need to enter your email address. You do not need to enter a link and you do not need to enter a title. The only thing I need is your first name and your last initial. After that, you're going to click submit and that sends the video to me to approve. Then you can watch other kids' videos and you can click the little heart to let them know that you watched it and you loved their performance. And you did it. That's how you submit a Flipgrid video to our performance grid. I am so excited to see the amazing things that you have learned. I hope you have enjoyed these lessons as much as I did, and I will see you next time. Thank you again, and always keep practicing. Goodbye.